Hello everyone, it's great to be back with you all again. I hope you're all doing well and I wish you all the best in achieving your dreams and finding happiness. Today, I have some exciting news to share with you, for the first time in its history. Iraq's Barak has been elected to head the Council of Arab Information Ministers during the 54th session of the Council, currently being held in Manama, Bahrain. This is a significant achievement, and we are proud to see Iraq taking on this leadership role. According to a statement by the Media and Communications Commission, the head of the media authority, Ali al Muayyad, expressed his pride in the confidence of the Arab brothers in Iraq and its ability to lead joint Arab media work during the coming period. al Muayyad also explained that Iraq will work to strengthen and develop Arab media cooperation and confront the challenges facing the sector in a way that serves the interests of the Arab peoples and their just causes in other news. The Arab information ministers participating in the current session welcomed Iraq's embrace of the work of the Ministerial Council in its next session, wishing Iraq success in its presidential mission. Meanwhile, the United Arab Emirates has imported more than 800,000 barrels of fuel oil from Iraq in the past 10 days. According to data from analytics firm Kepa, this increase ends the longest, losing streak since 2020, driven by a slowdown in demand for marine fuel which led to gains in heavy distillates used for ship fuel and power generation. In addition, the Iraqi central bank's sales of the US dollar reached more than $269 million in the currency auction on Thursday, according to the bank's data. The majority of dollar sales were directed towards bolstering balances abroad in the form of transfers and credits, amounting to $249,500 representing a 90% increase compared to cash sales.